Uh, hey, how y'all doing out there? Uh, listen, uh, that's the road back up there. And uh, you see the bike I just came down on. A little path. Uh, my brother Mike and I were walking, walking to the store earlier. And we decided to take a different path than we were going to follow this whole power line. And as we was walking through here, Mike looked down and he said, Bill, look at this. And I just want to show y'all something very rare and very special. These are red ghost pipes, y'all. Now, you know we have talked about the ghost pipe, uh, how spiritual and magical and beautiful it is. And it's normally this white color. But look, if you look it up, it says something very rare strains are red. So I remember some stories, and there are some stories about the ghost pipes, uh, about the red ones. Uh, healing emotional pain, especially the broken heart, uh, loss of a loved one. Things, uh, love that would be blood related. So, um, I just can't believe that here they are. Right here in just the middle of a very beautiful spot. A little creek running down the side here, waterways. Mountain goes up that way. I heard a few dogs barking that way. There's a house across the street and there's an old barn. And the frackers use this a little bit, but look at that, y'all. So I have a sister coming that said that she was really wanting to make some ghost pipe tincture. She said it was especially for emotional pain. So I'm going to let these sit here tonight, and I hope they make it through. And uh, I'm going to let her come and let her pick them and let her make the, the tincture herself and make something for herself. Because this is what we've been talking about, y'all. Uh, people like me, I guess, can come out here and find things and, and show you many, many things. But you can come and make it. You can come and heal yourself. Anyway, enjoy it. That's a rare, beautiful uh, ghost flower plant, y'all. Enjoy it. I love you. Peace. And don't live in fear. The mother provides everything we need. Even emotional pain. Peace.